Tipping Point fans were left disgruntled just moments into the show as host Ben Shepard announced a brand new episode. On Thursday's installment of the popular ITV game show, Ben was joined by three fresh contestants hoping to bag a hefty cash prize. The hopefuls included complaints manager Joe from South Wales, creative director Amara from Birmingham, and catering manager Clifton from Preston. Before the game commenced, Ben revealed they were going to shake things up in the studio for the new episode, celebrating the show's 10th anniversary. He stated, I may not be allowed to shake the machine but to celebrate Tipping Point turning 10 this year we have been allowed to shake things up in the studio. Just three lucky players will get to grips today but will any of them walk away with a jackpot, let's find out. On brand new Tipping Point. He added, it's the start of a brand new series and a brand new setup. Three players will be facing our machine and they are all hoping to win thousands of pounds today, reports the Daily Star. However, sharp-eyed viewers quickly noticed that the episode was actually a rerun, prompting swift reactions on social media. One viewer tweeted, it said new but it's a repeat hashtag tipping point. Another wrote, come on at ITV if you are going to repeat the show at least show older episodes. Hashtag tipping point. Another expressed disappointment, past few weeks since the new episodes aired, they've slipped in repeats on a Friday, now it's Thursday as well. I've had enough hashtag tipping point. Meanwhile, someone else noted, I'm pretty sure this isn't a new episode. How strange. In the end, contestant Amara triumphed to the final round, pocketing £2,950 without risking her winnings at the last hurdle. During the show, host Ben Shepard inquired about Amara's plans for her prize money. She enthusiastically responded, I've been thinking about this for years but because my boyfriend basically applied for me I would split a bit of it with him and maybe take my kids on holiday to the Maldives. If we have cash left I would put it towards a house.